Uh, Banjo Pants Loose Part Two. The small, sl the slightest. Uh, Modifications. Yeah, we drilled bigger holes than this on the underside. We built a plastic uh, PVC stand for it. You gotta show them the stand, buddy, because otherwise you can't see it. I got my, got my pump hanging from the underside. Ten gallons of water. Yep, only ten gallons of water running through it right now. Pack this dirt, and we know it has gold in it. Yep, we put some gold in it. And we'll do a cleanup when we're done. Mine's nice and slow. Yep, not too bad for a little cleanup sluice or a little uh, testing sluice for the testing area. Oh. Kind of nice because everything will fit for one 17 gallon coat. Pump, battery, sand. And then we're just trying to carry in hand tools and some buckets and make it easy to take out and see what we can find. Yep, just a short video for today. We'll do a clean up and show you when we're done. Yep. Alright, so we're Finish running a bucket of dirt, and we're using the the gold claw pocket pan, which is a tremendous pan. It's a tremendous pan. I mean, you can really get down to the fine stuff, and it keeps everything in the pan. Mm -hmm. This is just the first banjo, the top banjo pan. We got a double system. And it is literally, let's see if I can clean that out a little bit better for us. It is literally catching darn near everything in the top. I haven't checked the bottom one yet. That'll come next. Mm -hmm. This is the first time I've ran dirt through there with any gold in it that I know. Been running my practice dirt. You can see the amount of black sands that are in here. That's why I use it as a practice dirt. And it really starts to show itself. Oh, yeah. Oop, one piece went out. That's why I got a safety pan. <laughs> well, these, uh, basically, they have three sets of riff riffles. They have this set here. This set, like, with the smaller stuff and then the bigger riffles on top. And then a little tiny for, like, your finishing set. And this can get your gold clean. Oh, it's all. <laughs> it just all covered itself. Just covered itself. Yeah. But it really pops out in these two pans. Pretty sure that's the amount of gold that I put in that in that bucket to begin with. Okay, I'm gonna show it. So I'll I'll finish cleaning this stuff. Finish cleaning it out again, but this is just kind of the initial run of that little setup with the actual gold in my dirt. So pretty excited to see all of this, all of this shiny yellow, shiny gold in the first banjo pan, the top banjo pan of that little sluice aspect. And there's it just all showing up. This is the finished side of the pocket pan, which if you don't have a gold gold claw, I highly recommend them. I also highly, oh, oh another, another piece of I'll gold went out. I don't have any uh, jet dry in here, but you can see. So if people tell you.